Uh, hi, in this video, we will talk about handling drop downs using Playwright. Okay, so for this, I created one class called handling drop downs test and I created a test, test ng test method handle drop downs. Okay, and I'm going to use this website so demo.automationtesting.in slash register.html. So here I have a skills drop down. You see that? I have skills drop down in the same way date of birth means year month day so these are all drop downs when you inspect this these are developed using this select class sorry select tag okay select tag inside that you have multiple options so if it is a select then you can directly select a value from the drop down okay so for that I'll create a playwright instance first. Playwright.create and then page instance. Page is equals to playwright.create. So launch options. Browser type dot launch options dot set headless false dot new page so then page dot navigate this url i'm going to navigate so after this what i need to do so i will wait for three seconds so after that i need to select skills skills has id okay then i can use this id and what is that we need to use page dot select option you see that select option selector and values okay what is that selector hash skills and inside that what value i can select from here We have Java, okay? We'll select the Java from here. That's it. That simple it is. And then playwright dot close. So let me execute this and see whether it is selecting Java from the dropdown or not. So you observe the skills drop down. You see that it selected Java. All right, that simple it is. The method is select option. You need to use select option and the first parameter is selector and second parameter is the which value you want to select from this. And you can do the same thing in another way, so page dot locator, and the same way you have, you see that select option only it is expecting single value. Okay, what is that? So let me take month. So placeholder is equals to month. Okay. So I'll take this one. And I'll select September from the month drop down. So let me execute again. You observe the behavior. First, it will select the Java from the skills. It already selected. 
and now observe the month. You see that it selected September. And after three seconds, close the browser. Right. That simple it is. Page dot select option or page dot locator dot select option. Any one of these things you can use to select a value from the drop down, which is developed using select tag. So if it is different type of tags, uh, sorry, means yeah, tags means div or something they use, then the logic will be different according to the behavior of your application. But if it is a select tag and option tags, then this method directly selects the value from the drop down. You see, page dot select option, otherwise page dot locator dot select option. Okay. So this is how you can handle the or select the values from the drop down using playwright. Okay. That's all in this video. Thank you for watching this video. So please like the video, share the video, and now put your thoughts in the comment section and subscribe to the channel for interesting updates. Thank you.